A new era tonight for our Houston Texans, hours after head coach and general manager Bill O'Brien got the boot. O'Brien's firing comes as the team lost its fourth game in a row yesterday. We do have live team coverage for you tonight. We begin with Channel 2 Sports Director Randy McElvoy. Yeah, big news today. Texans chairman and CEO uh, Calvin Nair witnessed firsthand the state of his football team yesterday. The loss to the Vikings at Energy Stadium and the way they have been losing did not sit well with McNair. He slept on it and this afternoon one phone call ended the tenure of Bill O'Brien. O'Brien in six plus seasons at the helm leaves as the only coach in team history with a winning record. He finishes up 52 and 48. He's had his moments uh, during his time as head coach and now GM including four AFC South titles. But his downfall began really last January with the playoff collapse in Kansas City. And this year, the team's shown little improvement. In fact, the offense has taken a step back with quarterback Deshaun Watson in his fourth year. Before leaving NRG Stadium late this afternoon, O'Brien met with the media. I really want to thank the McNair family. Uh, you know, Cal, Janice, uh, Hannah, um, obviously the late Bob McNair for for just giving me and my family this opportunity you know in the end you know in this business it's a bottom line business we weren't able to get it to where we needed to get it you know we won four AFC South division titles in in six years and and I think that's a a good accomplishment it's not good enough but uh, we did a lot of good things here Calvin Nair added today Romeo Cornell will take over as interim head coach for the Texans for the remaining part of the season. We have much more from O'Brien coming up in sports, plus more on a big Astros win as well. We'll see you then. All right. Thank you, Randy.